Today's the feast of the first American citizen to be canonized, St. Francis Cabrini. Hello, I'm Father James Kabicki, and there are a number of interesting things about this holy woman, our first U.S. saint. First, she was an immigrant from Italy who became a citizen. As a little girl, she wanted to be a missionary, and she used to dress up her dolls as nuns and make paper boats which she would float across a pond, imagining that they were going to China. She searched for a missionary order and eventually approached Pope Leo XIII, who told her to start a new order, the Missionary Sisters of the Sacred Heart. But instead of sending her to China, the Pope sent her to the U.S. to care for the numerous Italian immigrants who'd come to our shores. The order spread throughout the world, and Mother Cabrini, as she'd come to be known, became a U.S. citizen in 1909 and died in 1917. When he canonized her in 1947, Pope Pius XII said that the source of her strength and inexhaustible energy came through the divine love which burned within her. It was the fire of the Sacred Heart of Jesus which inflamed her heart with the desire to make Jesus known to all people. She once wrote, What have we to fear if the heart of Jesus protects us? Let us keep our eyes fixed on the wound in that heart. Let's follow Mother Cabrini's advice today and imagine in our mind's eye the heart of Jesus pierced out of love for us. Acknowledging that love, let's close with a prayer of Mother Cabrini. Fortify me with the grace of your Holy Spirit and give your grace to my soul that I may be free from all needless anxiety and worry. Help me to desire always that which is pleasing and acceptable to you so that your will may be my will. Amen.